He is known for being a romantic composer and chemist of Georgian-Russian extraction. He was part of a group called The Five, dedicated to creating uniquely Russian classical music. His name is Alexander Porfirievich Borodin. In the realm of classical music, one name stands out as a legendary figure, Alexander Borodin. Born in 1833, Borodin was a composer and chemist of Georgian-Russian descent. He was part of a group of prominent 19th-century composers known as The Five, who aimed to create a uniquely Russian style of classical music. While Borodin is best known for his symphonies, two string quartets, and the symphonic poem, In the Steps of Central Asia, his impact extended beyond the world of music. Prior to his musical pursuits, Borodin was a doctor and chemist. He made significant contributions to the field of organic chemistry, including groundbreaking work on nucleophilic substitution and co-discovering the aldol reaction. Despite his achievements in chemistry, Borodin considered it more of a primary occupation, dedicating his spare time or moments of illness to his true passion, music and composition. Borodin's dedication to education was evident in his role as a promoter of learning in Russia. In fact, he founded the School of Medicine for Women in St. Petersburg, where he also served as a teacher until 1885. His commitment to advancing education and empowering women showcased his broader impact on society beyond his musical and scientific achievements. Alexander Borodin's legacy is a testament to his multifaceted talents and unwavering dedication to both the arts and sciences. His compositions continue to captivate audiences with their rich melodies and distinct Russian flavor. Moreover, his contributions to the field of organic chemistry have left a lasting impact on scientific research. Borodin's life serves as an inspiration, reminding us of the profound significance of pursuing our passions and making meaningful contributions to the world. In the late 19th century, Alexander Borodin's music began to gain recognition outside of the Russian Empire, thanks to the efforts of notable individuals. Franz Liszt, a renowned composer himself, arranged a performance of Borodin's Symphony No. 1 in Germany in 1880, introducing his music to a wider audience. Additionally, the Comtesse de Mercy Argento played a vital role in promoting Borodin's compositions in Belgium and France. Borodin's music was known for its powerful lyricism and rich harmonies. While influenced by Western composers, his work also embraced a distinct Russian style as a member of the Five, a group of composers dedicated to creating a uniquely Russian musical identity. This combination of passion and unique harmonies had a lasting impact on younger French composers, such as Debussy and Ravel, who drew inspiration from Borodin's compositions. One of Borodin's most evocative works was, In the Steps of Central Asia. This piece, along with his Symphony No. 2 and his opera, Prince Igor, showcased his ability to create vivid musical landscapes. The beauty and emotional depth of these compositions led to their adaptation in the 1953 musical, Kismet, by Robert Wright and George Forrest. Songs like, Stranger in Paradise, and This is My Beloved, and, Baubles, Bangles, and Beads, featured melodies derived from Borodin's music. The success of, Kismet, brought Borodin posthumous recognition, as he was awarded a Tony Award in 1954 for his contributions to the show. This accolade not only honored Borodin's talent but also solidified his musical legacy as his compositions continued to captivate audiences long after his passing. Do you want to explore more composers? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.